licks, told you black, 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 call a meal on his wrist. Black, 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 what a bad man. I ain't got the bag, and now everything is. I don't even need too many ad libs on it. W E L T 95.7. Do not touch it down. You ain't gotta check your radio. You ain't gotta check your system. You already know what time it is. We're coming in here. New year, new gear, new look. Let's go. <laughs> if you ain't know what you was tuning into, this is live from last night. Which us truly know the D A M E dance, art, music, entertainment, and everything else. Live from last night. I already told you what it is, Mama. Explain what it is on this show. This after the new year. Let's go. It's almost like a theme song. We got that Jason Derulo no news coming up. We got that uh, K Camp cancellation coming up. We got a whole lot of stuff we talking about, but this is almost like the theme song. This is almost instructions for boys. You understand me? As always, I'm gonna let you listen to that because y'all already know what that is, man. I got people in the building right now. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Let them know what time it is, man. We getting right into it. Let them know who I got to the left of me right now. P Lotus. Okay, P Lotus. And what you do? What, what, where they know you from? Man. P.H.E. Phenomenal Entertainment. We out here, man. Okay, what else you got going on? Because I'm, I'm, you almost acting like right. I don't know nothing about that Midwest Trap TV. Yes, or sir. Okay, yeah, that's Midwest what's going Trap on. TV. Okay, we pushing that out. Uh -huh. Um, we got things going on. Doing a lot. Yeah, yeah. You know, uh, new shows okay. and uh, content coming. A lot of content. So. Yeah, Stay look, look at Midwest Trap TV on YouTube, Stay and then also um, <laughs> there you go. on Facebook, yeah. we got a Midwest Trap Facebook group, and that's where y'all need to submit links. If you're an artist and you're making music, submit, submit your links and your music yeah. so we can get in touch with you. We'll bring you on the show. We'll um, put your music on our top 10 or all on our, um, yeah, our, our Hottest in the City radio all type of stuff. segment. All, type of stuff, all of that. So um, get with us. Hottest in the City tour coming in, in March. Yeah. So y'all can look for them dates. All right, that's what's up. And who else we got in the building to the left of him, to the far left of me? Yeah, Hold man. On. It's your boy CJ, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah Midwest with? Trap TV, uh -huh. you know? I'm um, working on my own thing right now. I'm trying to think of a name right now. So, uh, so what you got? Yeah, I'm brainstorming about that right now. But, you know, we going to be um, covering uh, Midwest, uh, Midwest artists, you know? Try to give um, light on, uh, you know, that, that quadrant of the uh, world and whatnot. Okay. Because I feel like, you know, we don't, get that, much, yeah, we don't get that much. Yeah, we don't get that much. Rec yeah, yeah, man, we ain't getting recognition like that, man. Agreed. Like you know, I Agreed. feel like um, we get overlooked. Absolutely. Hey, right. Nelly, Nelly wasn't the only one who did it, man. You know what I'm saying? That was just one, you know, uh, fragment of the spectrum. And people. that's the problem. You, you know, know what I mean? But you we know. gotta get that exposure. We in the perfect time for exposure, though. And yes, this sir. time we using this platform right here, W E L T, which stands for We Encourage Local Talent. But also the affiliate stations is live seventy two point three. I did that about. 12, 13 years ago. You know what I'm saying? That was a real live radio station. It was mm -hmm. a short bus radio station. Anybody know what time it is, they know what short bus talking about. Yeah. And also, Power 109. We trying to get like a link to Power 109. So now you're going to be listening to live from last night. My yeah. main show when it dropped. And my line and whatever P. Lotus come off with. And hey, yeah. we, we, we put all them joints <laughs> over there on Power 109. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Doing all that. So yeah, we in tune. We in tune. Hi, no pun intended, man. You know what I'm saying? Definitely. There's some stuff going on. You know what I mean? I don't know if it's a little... A a little static. I don't know one's feeling like I shouldn't have said anything, but um, like the biggest news. First of all, let me tell y'all what live from last night is. We got people in here. Live from last night is a mix of somebody attending the venue. So we got a venue attendant correspondent. We got a little bit of com uh, comedy. You know what I mean? Uh, we got entertainment, and then we got my insight and research all mixed in one. Okay. We're going to play a little bit of songs, you know, but it's live from last night. It's basically not actual last night, because even though you're hearing this on Friday morning, 10 in the a.m., make sure you're marking that on your calendar and your schedule. Even though you're hearing it then, it doesn't necessarily have to be last night. It can be right, the last right. night where something was live, you feel me? You know yeah. what I mean? Because yeah. your, your, your Thursday, your Wednesday night might not have been jumping. Late night Tuesday, that's when you slide <laughs> off with that dip that you don't really want nobody to know that you actually doing that. Late night Tuesday when it's raining, you feel me? That's what <laughs> so, yeah, the rainy that. day. Like, yeah, the rain is the effect. You know what I'm saying? But uh, that's what it is. So we try to bring that all into a pocket, and we try to do that for the first 15 minutes. So right now, in this first 15, we just going to talk about um, how this in the city. We got to talk about how this in the city for the simple fact that I think well, let's talk this, about it. Hey, this is the perfect time for him to go ahead and put a distinction mm -hmm. between what it is that you do, and I'm talking about P Lotus. PHE Live. I'm talking about what you do versus what may be learned about this weekend. Because mm -hmm. I think today, mm -hmm. something called Live, uh, uh, Hottest in the City is jumping off 
tonight, absolutely. You know what I'm saying? I think it's actually going down at uh, the ruin. You know what I'm saying? If, 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 if memory serves me correct, and their demonstration is called how to in the city. city yeah. So let's go ahead and give a distinction in the first 15, mm. let them know so we don't get it confused because I was ready to go. I was like, my man ain't telling me nothing about this until I got to looking at the names. <laughs> and I didn't know none of the right. names. And I was like, these graphics kind of weird. No this. I just didn't know. You know what I mean? So now that you here, you was like, I don't know nothing about that. I was like, oh, okay. Boom. Well, yeah. Here. Yeah, when you, you brought it to my attention, I did see that uh, it was an event out mm -hmm. here called Hottest in the City. And that's actually not the first event that I've seen called Hottest in the City after we launched Hottest in the City mm. tour. Mm. Okay, so um, to me, that's a distinction. Um, and just uh, for the record, you know, the, the event that's going on in Fort Wayne, supposedly, mm. that's not something that I'm associated with or Hottest in the City tour is associated with. It's no. something different no. that, um, that people came up with on their own, I assume. You know what I mean? And... So that's pretty much the description. How to send the city tour is what we're coming with. And I don't really see anyone else uh, going with that verbiage. Cause if they use those words, then that's, we yeah. Cause we came first, you know what yeah, I mean? But um, do don't do that. How to send the city as a phrase, um, people are gonna use that and that's cool. Yeah. But when, when you hear how to send the city tour, that's when you know that's us. That's that's something that we stamped and we trademarked. That's phenomenal entertainment. Phe, Nikki, Neptune, Violet. Like we we launched that, and that's, that's you know what I mean. We gave birth to that. That's hottest in the city tour is us. So make yeah. make sure if you do see hottest in the city tour and it's something that I'm not attached to, let me know because that's, that's P -Lotus. you know so that's something if we have to move on. You know what I mean? If it's not approved, <laughs> then don't. Not saying don't. Now, look, let's get, we not being. We just like people do brands, you know what I mean? Like like Denzel had to come in at Hollywood Nick, you know, it's the name brand, you know. Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And he checked them about that demonstration, but he wasn't really he was just like, You can do whatever you want to do with yours, but we just can't have a confusion that it's actually affiliated under the same umbrella. Exactly. Especially if I don't actually know. And it's uh people could be like, they can get technical, well, did you copyright it? Did you <laughs> do you got rights to it and everything else? It's just the fact for this city, you know what I mean? As far as this city goes, you know, there's all, you in what season right now? Season four you coming You in up. season four. So this ain't yeah. like this just start, this ain't like we just kind of went at the same time and then we happen to come with the same. This is season four that my man's coming up on. And it's like, how did you hear, how did you even, I want to know the creative process by which somebody came up with Hottest in the City. Mm -hmm. Coincidentally, after we're in season four of Hottest yeah. in the City. That's all yeah, I'm that's, saying. That's People ridiculous. don't like, I, That's absolutely, it's, it's, yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's just a little, it's a little aggy. You know what I mean? So we're not saying, oh, don't attend that demonstration because no. it's not the, it's not what we're saying. We're just saying. No way. It's just pay homage, man. It's just pay homage. Maybe you can reach out. Does anybody else? Research, because I think if ones with a research, to see, hey, before we name this venue how to send the city, let's see if anybody else has that. And then PHE Live would have came through. Yeah. Then it would have been a meeting that ones would have not necessarily had to have, but they wanted to have. Hey, yo, listen, we came up with this name, how to send the city, found out that you already had it. Maybe we could link up. Everybody think ones be hating or something. No, no, maybe this is a, a, a way for us to collectively get together. But you know, until then, it's just the proper channels got to be evolved or something you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. 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 And you know you always gonna have soon. people that you like know that. ride a wave sometime and Facts. it's not about hating but when you put a lot of work into a brand to mm -hmm. make it known and to have a certain reputation behind it right a lot of time money and energy into building a brand yeah you got to protect it because people will they'll try to you know what they call it uh counterfeit mm -hmm. your brand you know what i'm saying so won't, you won't gotta be careful, it. And, and and it just it it kind of hurts what you've been investing. It hurts what you've been doing. So it's yeah. important yeah. to 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 not you know what I mean just to make that distinction of you know what's going on and beware that it does happen that some people will try to ride a wave. So buyer you beware, be you know what I'm saying? For the buyers, make sure y'all yeah is it, know what y'all buying into. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Make sure it's the real deal. Just like you gotta do your research before you buy anything and make sure that. It's not, you know, watered down. <laughs> don't, yeah, don't on. think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, completely out there. Yeah. Just got to find that demonstration, man. 
Yeah, um, shout out Authentic Empire. Authentic, man. yeah. Boom, man. Big uh, things, money man. Move. Uh, my man, what's my man name? Fujiano. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I, I can, I, I'm going to shout out them people because, you know, I got their music in here and they had a clean version of their music. So, <laughs> word out to the local artists. Don't think I'm just, oh, you trying to ride the wave of the people that's already on. No, get me the clean versions. Yeah. This is a radio show. You know what I mean? <laughs> me children are in the car. You feel yeah. me? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it's yeah. more people should be on that. I know y'all. Y'all y'all loose with your podcast and your your uh whatever your lives that you go and you can be unfiltered and everything else, but in order to get the exposure and get around people that you need to grow your platform, you need some kind of content that they can play on the radio. You can't play certain stuff at a kid's birthday party, you know what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. people don't know what they're doing. So Check yeah, it. clean it up, clean, clean it, it up, up man. You know? Yeah. Now speaking of names, uh before we get into this uh fifteen after the hour, it's right now ten. We want to talk about this name. We want to delve into it. What is your process? Passing it to my man, CJ. What is your process? Because you're coming up with a show right now. And I know you're being very careful as to not name your show something else that's already jumping. Speaking mm -hmm. to the highest in the city situation. So what's your process about how you going about that? Yeah, right I now? just want it to be original. Absolutely. Like, yeah, just something like, you know, spontaneous. Mm -hmm. Like, it just came from my brainchild or something like you know so or it was a group it. decision right. like it's yeah that sound good rolling you know when you say it you know mm -hmm. i ain't just finna just oh this what it is just what it is boom i like that yeah it, it, it sound good yeah. 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 Okay, yeah i feel you um what what do you feel like your show is going to encapsulate or embody what is it's it? gonna embody what's been missing from the void for a minute like mm -hmm. i want to bring that like i was telling him earlier like i want to bring that 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 when rap was fun you know right used to love you know flipping on bt and just yeah you know watching rap city uh, you know yeah. watch you know you know big tigger see what he bringing through you know yeah, yeah, yeah. i see somebody freestyling and talking about their new you know most definitely yeah you know so okay. i want to bring that feeling back you know that's been missing for a long time so yeah we're doing and that. um yeah i want that back yeah. but i want it like the midwest version back to what i was saying earlier about us being overlooked mm -hmm. like i want to you know put a spotlight on that completely okay. but it's just gonna feature like you know if you're from the midwest like you know it's a lot of quadrants you know yeah you from here to minnesota absolutely you know pittsburgh you know so you know, you know so it's you know yeah. i just wanted to encapsulate that Okay. If it's gonna encapsulate anything, it's gonna definitely do that. Yeah, it's a whole. To be overly, y'all not gonna keep yeah, doing this. Yeah, yeah. You know, man, the South look after each other. New yeah. York look after each other, man. Come on, man. Yeah, for real, bro. and it's a yeah. I feel you. Reggaeton, I mean, reggaeton, look out for reggaeton do. artists. They you know, they do. like. Come on, man. Like they hold it down. Like so, when you think about that, and you think about how. We get it's out. so many artists that could have just got together and mm -hmm. just, but we yeah, want to be for he stole my style, all this yeah. stupid stuff. So, yeah. nah, man, let's nah. not do that. Let's, let's, let's not do that. Yeah, like, 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 slow that down. We can, we can still have our moments. You know, mm -hmm. it's, it's a lot of cities that's, you know, imploding with they beef right now, but they got hard artists, and then at least some of them artists are clicking up with each other. And but like the music, said, but like you, you said, know. it was when it was back in the day. It was it that was the whole element for you to bring something else to it, and it was kind of like, all right, so we got A, B, C, and D. You bring it E. Yeah, we want E here. Yeah. We don't want to say ah nah scratch E. Yeah. Yeah, you know what I mean, move on to another D or another C. Yeah, you know let's saying? see right. what he got let's real finish, quick. Let's finish the puzzle, man. Can he, can he, he got, spit? Can he spit? Can he, Even if he if, is he graffiti, is he is he is he dancer? Is yeah. he rapper? Is he man? Like all that. If he wrong, he wrong. If he wrong, mm -hmm. he wrong. Whatever he doing, if he styling, if, if he just fresh, if he whatever, it's just like everybody, everybody not paying enough attention to to individualizing themselves first of all, and then letting that individuality. Be a part of the bigger picture. Yeah, it's almost like now nah, we don't come want that part in here. Nah, come on, man. Come on, like Voltron, you know I mean? yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. We gotta, on, man. Let's get a bigger robot, man. Yeah, yeah. man. Like, they, I, they, I, they, I, you got, on. you got, you got Atlanta running around with Gundams right now, man. Yeah. Like they got the full. Some of these, you got New Yorkers over here with Megazords and exactly. stuff, man. Like, come on, man. We, we got, got nothing over here, bro. Got, we got Hummers. We, got and we getting body. stepped on, bro. We, we getting got, stepped on, bro. It. It's not cool, North. man. I need an extra rocket launcher on on the right arm. You know, one mid, one mid. It take one Midwest artist to say something crazy about a a a big guy 
that side. media from right. the other side and we get and buried. Buried. Because they coming through. They like, who is they? Then it's this is then it's this is left and right. And you yeah. you like, dang man, man, what happened to dude? Well, yeah. Oh man, he haven't made an album since, <laughs> since you know since he, he got since bodied he said, by bro. Yeah, since he said something. Since <laughs> you he know got, since he got the talking out of his face. You yeah, since phone them, phone them, phone them bodied him. So <laughs> so phone them can't even make an album no more. You, you know, can't do that. He, he ain't even got no, you know, no 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 momentum no more. Because phone them been dissed him so much, he fifty cent at him. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. Hey man, so listen, live from last night, WET ninety five point seven for right now. Hey, look, we fifteen past the hour. What we about to get into is live from last week. Some of the biggest news last <laughs> week was that demonstration that happened was the K Camp cancellation. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna talk a little bit about it. We just gonna talk, hey, we're gonna put it out there. Once was kinda heated, they wanna deny and say they weren't feeling no type of way, but they were for right now. <laughs> <laughs> for right now. We're gonna get into this right here. You know what I'm saying? Cause we still gonna play them. You know what I mean? We ain't hating. I just think it was a certain situation and ones they talking about. Live from last night, your boy P Lotus, your boy CJ, your dang, your dang, your boy dang, man. Let's go. Yeah, we back. We back live. Mike's on fire. You understand? You know it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I said, we ain't doing no hate. We gonna, we gonna, we gonna st still let them rock. That was one of my favorite songs right there. You know what I'm saying? I heard that in a real, uh, a real troubling place. You feel me? Could wait, <laughs> could wait. I'm bumping that. You know what I'm saying? WLT. 95.7, you know what I'm saying? You ain't here with live from last night. Uh, this person was told that there's no way that you can have a viable, non-commercial radio station in Fort Wayne. And he told the naysayers, watch me. And we talking about Eric Moberg. These are the studios we in. We in Will Studio One right now. He got two of them and he's the reason we doing this. But rest in purpose to him because he's up there looking down on us as we do this. You understand me? If you one of those youngsters that act like you can't start the car unless you got the ox core bumping and you don't do the radio. Matter of fact, you don't listen to the radio A. As you are getting your other phone together or something else put your phone in why is the radio on you understand me you can log into this with your digital self www.weltfm.org so yes, now sir. we are past the first 15 of this demonstration we're about 19 minutes into this and uh k camp cancellation did y'all hear about the k camp concert Oh, definitely. Uh, yeah, yeah, I heard about the New Year's Eve supposed to be live at the demonstration that it was on, right? Yeah. When did y'all hear that it was getting canceled? Uh, maybe like a day or two. Day or two. Before. Before that. Okay, cool. You know what I mean? Uh, I know I'm you. Keep it on. I, I didn't know. You didn't know, <laughs> you didn't know it got canceled or you didn't know he was here? No, I knew he was here. I just didn't know it got canceled. I okay. thought he was just going to come here, been there, done it. I okay. wasn't too interested in participating. You know, Absolutely. Family. Um, I guess I guess it's post it's only proper that I say that it's a um it's a postponement. That's what's being said. Man, one's gonna think I'm sneak this and so I might as well <laughs> say, you know what I mean, that I'm just putting it out there that I believe there was something else going on. Yes, I could li listen to another show. Here's my thing. I'm going to give y'all some information that y'all might not have known. Like my, my, my man said, he didn't even know that it got canceled or whatever. So I'm going to give you some information, this research. I wasn't doing this for no other reason. When I seen it was canceled, I actually reached out to a couple people about tickets. Like, man, New Year's Eve, what we doing New Year's Eve? I kind of want to go ahead, KK. Yeah. Do I really know about them? Nah, I didn't until I got to researching out how many songs. Cause you you listen to your town. That's how much I mess with the town. Cause the town was already like, oh, we always get these washed up artists and everything. Else. That's what they said. You know what yeah. I mean? Hey, let me just put this out. Any kind of opinion exposed on here is not the direct opinion of the ACPL, Allen County Public Library, nor is it of WELT ninety five seven. It is only that of the personality, Notre D A M E, P Lotus, or C J. Yeah. It's our own separate opinion. So, yeah. for Wayne was talking about, bro, he washed up anyway. <laughs> we ain't coming out. So, that's the first thing. Let's just keep it all the way funky. I'm not just talking about, oh, what's happening? Let's keep it all the way funky. All right. So, there it was. They were saying that. So, when I did re the research, I was like, okay, I like 100. And then I got to hearing a whole bunch of other songs. Oh, what's man. on your mind? Um, Comfortable. You know what I'm saying? I was like, okay, this dude um, sing on um, there. All right. You know what I mean? That one song. Yeah. Good thing. Man, he got a couple tracks on this way. Yeah, he do. He do now. Nah, 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 he got some. Now here's the thing. Also, he gonna bring them vibes out too. Let's keep it one thousand. He gonna bring them vibes out. You know what I mean? If we if it ain't the case, hey, women love women love K Camp. Yeah, yeah. Even cut off. It ain't nothing to cut that. You know, right. even when he play that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, They're yeah. gonna be, yeah, cut her off. They talk about the side piece. All right, so, <laughs> so, so, so let me ask y'all this, okay? So, two days before it, now let me just tell you what, what I did. I, I clicked on a link because they still had the, the, the advertisement up. And when I cl clicked on it, 
I looked at the comments. When I looked in the comments, somebody said, hey, yo, it says the K Camp supposed to be in uh, Kansas mm. the same night that he supposed to be here. How that work? You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. They was actually asking the person who put it up. So the person who put it up went, researched, did what he did, and then he came back and he actually used the message because the person who said he supposed to be in Kansas, Lawrence, Kansas, he sent him the demonstration. So he sent it like, hey, yo, what's this? I guess he was talking to KCAM people, like, what's this? And KCAM people allegedly answered back, like, I don't know what that is. We're going to have to check that out. We're going to have to flag that, okay? Damn. All right, now, coincidentally, a flyer still came out from Lawrence, Kansas. New Year's Eve bash. Boom, can't say prices on here, but it looked like it was still going down. I actually looked That's at how far Kansas, I didn't know really where Kansas was from Indiana. It's too far. I would've went. I would've went just to see if he actually showed up here. But first people was talking about, oh, it was COVID. Oh, y'all need, y'all always trying to throw a promoter under the bus. No, we looking at, boom, he in two places, all right? First of all, Lawrence, Kansas put up a flyer and I'm getting this all off of one site. I ain't doing no extensive research. I ain't Googling. I ain't doing none of that. I'm getting this from one source, the same source that I heard about the K Camp concert from. So yeah. now, in your opinion, what does that look like? What hmm. does that look like? K Camp supposed to be in two different places. Bad management. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Okay. All right. That, that, that makes that. it look like the either the management or the booking agents don't got yeah, all their stuff get, together. You yeah, know what I mean? They don't, don't like, like they or they don't have things confirmed. Right. right. Somebody didn't have it confirmed. That's what it sounds like. Exactly. It sounds like like somebody didn't have that that it wasn't that much communication with the promoter and the manager. Yeah. It, don't, it don't necessarily look like K Camp's camp per se. <laughs> but was, it's you know, mm -hmm. uh, trying to play you know both sides yeah they wasn't trying to do that it was like, i don't see that because that'd be a waste of time and that look bad on his brand and that I'd mess with his money so yeah i'm mm -hmm. pretty sure that was just bad management and not communicating with the promoter man mm -hmm. or bad promotion or bad promotion or now i'm gonna put this this way everybody like they don't like it's not necessarily that it doesn't make sense they don't like I think I done thought about it that much. I ain't thought about it that much. Let me tell you what I think happened. All right. So look, y'all both. This wasn't no regular date. All right. This was New Year's Eve. This wasn't like no April 9th or something, something like that. This was New Year's Eve. This is a real big night. Okay. Boom. You want K Kemp. All right. Smooth. K Kemp want X amount of dollars. You feel me? Lawrence is offering that they want K Kemp on New Year's too. Now, I'm going to speak to K Kemp <laughs> just so y'all don't think that I'm... Uh, uh, dragging down our city. Listen to me. If we was already punched in for New Year's Eve, me personally, as an artist, I don't care who comes after New Year's Eve, I'm already booked. Mm -hmm. You can't book me. You can't double book me because I'm already booked. You feel what I'm saying? The only way that situation becomes a double booking is, well, they haven't covered the deposit or whatever. Because if I already got my money from them, I don't care what Lawrence, Kansas is talking about and vice versa. If Lawrence, Kansas already paid their money, sorry, Fort Wayne. You know what I mean? I have a prior engagement mm -hmm. now. So if the management double booked, you get what I'm saying? Even when he finds this out, because mind you, when they talked about the he supposed to be in Lawrence, Kansas, when that came out, that was two weeks before the postponement was announced. So once that got flagged, it had to be all right. So we now we know we double booked right now. Mm -hmm. So what do we do? Who paid their money? And I believe that's what it came down to. Hey, I'm gonna leave myself open for both cities. Whoever bring me the money first is the one I'm gonna go with. Now I'm gonna keep it all the way one thousand. This is what people don't want to hear. If I gave K Camp any amount of money and closed the deal, you're not postponing. I was supposed to have you on New Year's, and you gonna <laughs> you gonna come in February when you feel like it? Oh, bro, hey, no. I paid you bids in the front contract. Like, let me get that now. Run Boom! That now. Let me get run that now or get sued. We're mm -hmm. talking about a lawsuit, breach of contract. What you talking about, bro? I already paid you the money. I don't even want it back. You better be here. If you're not here, yeah. you know what I'm saying. You gotta, you I'm gonna go, run that performance. I'm gonna man. run that perform. Hey, and this one I'm gonna do for all of my openers. Because it was openers on there. Mm -hmm. 
Mm. Oh, boom. Uh, Check it out. Hey, yo, K can't play, uh, K can't play this, but you know what? That can't stop the city from turning up. So all my openers that came down, whatever, if y'all still going to support the city, we still going to have a show, and then we're going to collectively sue K Camp for not showing up. Mm. That ain't what happened. What they That's hit us with. They hit us with the, dang. come on, stop playing with me, bro. They came yeah. with the postponement. Oh, we postponed. So you going to bargain with somebody you already paid? I ain't going, bro. I'm not going in 22. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Come on, bro. yeah I'm not I going in 22. Stop yeah, playing with me, bro. Yeah, that's yeah, that's bad business. Man, anybody in Lawrence, I might start getting Facebook friends in Lawrence to tell me <laughs> if, if it really <laughs> if it went down. <laughs> if it went right, down, right. Then. It went down. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Let did, me know. Hey, did K Cam show up, bro? I mean, what y'all do New Year's? That's how I'm started off. Hey, did phone them? Yeah, did phone them pull up? Right. Phone them did pull up. Keep it 100, buddy. Did, <laughs> did he pull up? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, they don't want to talk about that. Everybody act like, yeah, man, you can't. You, you, can't yeah. tell me, you know what I'm saying? So that's cool, man. Uh, what y'all want to hear? What y'all What y'all listening to right now? If I pop on one of y'all uh, tape decks, what y'all listening to right now? Man, a lot of Young Dolph. A lot of Young Dolph. I am not hip, man. I am not hip to the Dolph, man. I can say oh, that. Man. I can say that. He said. He said what? He said, bro, yeah. you got to. I, I don't know what to tell you. By <laughs> mistake, got dang, <laughs> got dang. Um, actually, the first Young Dolph song I ever heard was when I first moved out to this city. I was hanging with him, like mm -hmm. the first year I met met Lotus so, you know, over there and whatnot. Um, X. He was yeah, yeah. Uh, smoking oh. one while I'm rolling up. Yeah, yeah that was there. So it went from there. So I got more familiar with him. Yeah, he. he and what was the first song? Uh, smoking one while I'm rolling up. Oh, it was definitely my first Young Dolph song I ever heard. Um, okay. Ever since. Does he have yeah. anything radio friendly? <laughs> <laughs> um, he, like he got that one song he <laughs> did with Mad The Stallion. Um, yeah, but I'm pretty version. sure that's a radio edit version because that mm -hmm. played on radio plenty times. But uh, okay, uh, uh, my hundred shots I'm pretty sure played on the radio mm -hmm. around southern radio stations. You know, since it, you okay. know, okay, all right, you know. yeah. Well, you know what I'm saying. I don't know what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna see what happens. You know, understand me? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what my editing like. You know what I mean? I know Meg. She got she got bull. She got uh, she's a sailor. You know what I'm saying? When it come down to it, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah, I don't know yeah. enough about Young Dolph to be, really be like, oh, he be on one. But I know she girl. Listen, I, I don't know what you be having going on, but listen, we're gonna get into this right now. And, and, and hopefully, <laughs> and hopefully, she don't she don't get crazy. You know what I'm saying? Oh, it's a clean version. We should yeah, be good. Yeah, yeah, we, we should we, be good. We, we should, should be, be good. okay. Live from last night. If we not, we gonna we gonna really 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 come back again here. You know what I'm saying? The wackest dance move behind that. Silhouette that like, I was like, this dude is bogus. But but <laughs> throughout, throughout his career, the boy stepped his dances up. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie, that's the only thing I know about him. However, though, you know what I'm saying? Was he dating um Jordan Sparks? Jordan Sparks. Oh, he was. That's when he, I say uh, he's okay. Now you a player. Now 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 we can, dude, now man. we can stamp your player card. Jordan Sparks, bro. Yeah, yeah, true. Yeah. So how yeah. did how did this? Con confrontation play out though, man. man. And that's all we. Oh, somebody all this. said Usher. He said, "Ooh, what you said?" Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what that's you crazy. Said. Yeah, yeah. That's exactly I, how I all I seen. I saw somebody say "f you," and then I seen them get to swinging. So it's not playing. I didn't know if it was two. what it was really about. That's all. It was, that, that's all. It was, it was about. a little prank. Me that way. Yeah. <laughs> You don't know me that yeah. way. I tell you, bro. Hey, they baited him into that. Yeah, absolutely. Like <laughs> they got him. They got him. And, and they said that you can actually see people laughing. Like, the people who did it, you can actually see them running away laughing about it. Like, yeah, yeah you got him. Like, yeah, he wasn't right. playing. He wasn't. <laughs> yeah, 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 I don't care. Security couldn't hold it. That was a genuine. Bro, you can't hold me back. I don't know if y'all usually could... Uh, you know what I mean? Keep me restrained. Right. Not today. Bro, I don't know about something. getting knocked out by Jason Derulo, but, but them somebody got knocked that, out by Jason. Jason Derulo, bro. You got R &B knocked singer. out. 
R and B singer. Jason Derulo. Put the paws on you, fam. <laughs> <laughs> Put the skibbity pats on you, my dude. Yeah, they, you it mixed I mean? you up real it quick. Mixed you, mixed you real quick. You, know, you got mixed by Jason. Come on, you know him and Chris Brown was on the, the ninja type moves anyway. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So I really went. The boy got air. You feel me? The boy got wind. You see what I'm oh, saying? God. Boy might hit the knees or whatnot. You know what I mean? Yeah, like Kevin Hart said, anybody smack their knees twice. It's dangerous. You know what I'm <laughs> <laughs> so, like, you don't want to fight. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, so that was, like I said, last 48. Instead of the first 48, last 48 hours, that was probably the biggest news right now that was all streaming. Everybody knows Jason Derulo lost his cool right like, now. Nah, yeah, biggest nah, thing since, you know, Le the LeBron bow, you know. See, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm not even <laughs> interested, and I, I knew about that, you know. But, um, I guess I, I guess it's can it be called paying homage? I don't know if y'all ever heard this. You know, we're gonna get back into a little music, and we're going to play an artist that actually stuck to the to the most like way artist. You know what I mean? I went to one of his uh, parties. I believe it was um I know it was unplugged. I know that's how it ended. Uh, I want to say affirmation, maybe affirmation unplugged. He goes by the name Mike Strong. And he had a uh, hey, word out. Y'all heard the biggest news before we get into that? You know what I'm saying? The biggest news. The biggest news right now. We was actually we had, we had went into this um this 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 uh podcast. I had one of the first interviews from this guy. You know what I'm saying? If y'all go back and listen to my Christmas episode, I definitely had him. I had this. I had a clip. I had a sound clip. It wasn't necessarily in here. I had a sound clip. Yeah. But uh, Cam Coleman. Cam Coleman. You know what I'm saying? Uh, who got snacks? You know, snacks, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. he, he's now, he got a comedy special coming to the embassy. You know what I mean? He got a comedy okay. special coming to the embassy, you know, that's going down, I believe, February 12th at the embassy. You know what I mean? Oh, sure. So, yeah, 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 yeah. For more, oh. yeah, hold on, hold on. I see your reaction. Hold on, you know what I'm saying? For more information, we going to have some of those coming up. And uh, that's that's all going to be part of our last chance to dance, you know what I'm saying? But right now, we're going to, you know, for the people that's on their way, you can't be on your way to work because I... We air this at 10 o'clock in the a.m. So I don't know what kind of job you got that you can show up there. But you're possibly late. These are for mm -hmm. people that just happen to probably work third shift, uh -huh. happen to be up, work second shift, and you up before you got to do anyway. You know what I'm saying? Give you a little music if you're riding. Pop.